Chapter 9 The Names of Buddhas At that time, earth star Bodhisattva Mahasattva said to the Buddha, World honored one, I want to discuss some practices that will be helpful to beings of the future and will enable them to gain great benefit throughout their lives and deaths. World honored one, please hear my words. The Buddha told Earth Star Bodhisattva, Now, with your expansive compassion, you wish to discuss the inconceivable events involved in rescuing all those in the six paths who are suffering for their offenses. This is the right time. Speak now, since my nirvana is near, so that I may soon help you complete your vows then neither of us will need to be concerned about beings of the present or future. Earth Star Bodhisattva said to the Buddha, World Honored One, call this as Samkhya ends ago. A Buddha named Bali's body, First Come One, appeared in the world. If a man or women hear this Buddha's name and have a momentary thought of respect, those people will overstep the heavy offenses involved in birth and death for 40 years. How much more will that be the case for those who scorned or paint this Buddha's image or praise and make offerings to him? The merit they obtain will be limitless and boundless. Furthermore, in the past, as many years ago, as their grains of sand in the Ganges River. A Buddha named Jura Nature first came one appeared in the world. If a man or women hear this Buddha's name and instantly decide to take refuge, those people will never retreat from the unsurpassed path. Furthermore, in the past, a Buddha named Lotus Supreme first come one appeared in the world. If a man or women hear this Buddha's name, or if the sound of his name merely passes by their ears, those people will be reborn 1,000 times in the six desire heavens. How much more will that be the case if those people sincerely recite the name of that first come one? Furthermore, in the past, inexpressibly ineffable as Sankhya aeons ago, a Buddha named Lion's Ra first come one appeared in the world. If a man or woman hear this Buddha's name and in a single thought take refuge, those people will encounter numberless Buddhas who will wrap the crowns of their heads and bestow predictions of enlightenment upon them. Furthermore, in the past, a Buddha named Karakuchanda appeared in the world. If men or women hear this Buddha's name and sincerely gaze at, worship, or praise him, those people will become great Brahma heaven kings in the assemblies of the thousand Buddhas of the worthy Aeon and will there receive superior predictions. Furthermore, in the past, a Buddha named Vipassin appeared in the world. If men or women hear this Buddha's name, those people will eternally avoid falling into the evil paths, will always be born among people or gods, and will abide in supremely wonderful bliss. Furthermore, in the past, as many ends ago as there are grains of sand in limitless and countless Ganges rivers. A Buddha named Jord Victory Thus Come One appeared in the world. If men or women hear this Buddha's name, those people will never fall into the evil paths and will always abide in the heavens, experiencing supremely wonderful bliss. Furthermore, in the past, a Buddha named Jod Appearance Thus Come One appeared in the world. If a man or woman hear this Buddha's name and give rise to a thought of respect, those people will soon attain the fruitship of the fruitions of a hardship. 
Furthermore, limitless Asankhya ends ago, a Buddha named Kanshaya Banathas Kamwan appeared in the world. If men or women hear this Buddha's name, those people will overcome the offenses created throughout 100 great eons of births and deaths. Furthermore, in the past, a Buddha named Great Penetration Mountain King First Come One appeared in the world. If a man or women hear this Buddha's name, those people will encounter as many Buddhas as their grains of sand in the Ganges. Those Buddhas will speak Dharma extensively for them, making certain that they realize the Bodhi. Furthermore, in the past, there were Buddhas named Pure Moon Buddha, Mountain King Buddha, Wise Victory Buddha, Pure Name King Buddha, Accomplished Wisdom Buddha, Unsurpassed Buddha, Wonderful Sound Buddha, Full Moon Buddha, Moon Face Buddha, and indescribably many other Buddhas, World Honored One. Beings of the present and future, both gods and humans, both male and female, can amass such limitless merit and virtue by reciting only one Buddha's name. How much more merit will they amass by reciting many names? Those beings will personally obtain benefits in their lives and deaths significant enough to keep them from ever falling into the evil paths. When people are on the brink of death, a group of their relatives, or even just one of them, should recite a Buddha's name aloud for the people who are ailing. If they do, the karmic retributions of those people who are about to die will be dissolved even offenses deserving fivefold relentless retribution. Offenses warranting fivefold relentless retribution are so extremely heavy that those who commit them should not escape retribution for millions of ends. If, however, at the time of such offenders' deaths, someone recites the names of Buddhas on their behalf, then their offenses can gradually be dissolved. How much more will that be the case for beings who recite those names themselves? The merit they create will be limitless and will eradicate measureless offenses. <laughs> Ha ha ha, unsat modi so ha ha.